Hey guys, Evan Borsha here, and today I just want to do a uh, quick breakdown of this recent one-shot acoustic video that I did with Matt Marr. So one of the interesting things about these projects is that um, the goal is to do them as simply and naturally as possible. So they're they're really pretty simple, um, but I just kind of wanted to walk through the thought process. And thankfully, I had Mr. Jared Andre around um, to help record some behind the scenes stuff so you guys can kind of see what's going on. If you haven't seen this video yet, you can go to my Vimeo. Uh, vimeo.com slash eborsier and check it out um so a little bit of backstory um just on the equipment we were using there is the alexa mini um with a contax 28 millimeter on it and a one quarter pro mist um and i'm using my small hd 702 on my easy rig mini strong and that's kind of the the gear rundown there's no lighting this is all natural light um and yeah so this location is something that i actually came across a few months ago on a shoot i was filming something this is an old banquet hall that is owned by a church in connecticut and they're working on renovating it and they're kind of trying to raise funds and whatever so they asked me if um if I could come help do a video on their fundraising. So we came out there and was filming it. And I was like, this place is so cool. <laughs> Would you ever let me use it for a shoot before it gets fixed up? And they're like, yeah, sure, why not? Um, so I asked a few months later, I was like, hey, this guy's coming to town. We need a location for a video. Could we shoot here? And uh, they were so kind as to let me in. So big thanks to um, the church there for their willingness to let us use the space. If you go to the wide shot here, um, you can see we have three musicians, we have one microphone, um, and then a direct line running from the guitar. Both of those lines are running into a Zoom H6. The microphone is an MXR condenser, or not MXR, MXL um, condenser, and we decided to just kind of um, mic all three of these people in an ensemble kind of format rather than close miking everyone just for a different sound um, partially because this room was super reverby and we wanted to get a lot of that natural reverb too so this is a kitchen that is currently all torn apart um, so we were walking around the building and I decided this was my favorite place because um, there were a lot of cool lines and cool light and it was had some cool reverb but they do have some other cool rooms in there so if you see any other videos from me soon they might be from the same building um, so we picked this spot for them because there were kind of a couple fluorescent banks obviously you can see in this building and there was this one odd one that was slightly different color it was a little cooler and cleaner um, and off to the side and all the other ones kind of closer to the camera in the wide um, were dead so that was the most high contrast place we could put them that if I put them here um, we could kind of key them off this fluorescent over here and um, have kind of a decent light being cast on matte some cool backlight in the background with natural leading lines coming into this corner an interesting foreground element with this big walk-in refrigerator and we position them um, my general rule of thumb is you always point the girl towards the light because she's going to get the softest most flattering light matt goes in the middle because he's playing guitar so we kind of situated their overall um, orientation off of that and then you can let the guy just be silhouetted but girls generally it's not as cute to silhouette girls so that was the thought on why they're here. You know, if we'd pushed them back some, it, it wouldn't have been as contrasty. You wouldn't have gotten a, as cool a uh, shape of the light on their face. So we wanted to keep them out kind of in front of the lights for the most part. Um, and if we pulled them out too far, then there wouldn't have been any cool key light or anything. So this was the spot we were in. Um, after that, it's mainly just camera movement and taking it slow and easy and 
letting the song play out and kind of finding the shots as they go um, and trying not to, to step on anything that makes noise or will give you a horrible disease in this room. Um, but it worked out really well, so i um, super thankful for the opportunity to get to work with these guys and just wanted to give you guys a little insight into how we got this look. If you have any questions, feel free to comment below and let me know. Thanks so much. Bye. You restore my soul and you give me rest. All the memories of your